To help you out with creating the most powerful build for the rogue class, we have prepared this guide where we'll be listing down the best skills and familiars you can use to create the perfect Nino Kuni rogue build. This is Wyvern for another game enthusiast Nino Kuni video guide. The Rogue is the best long-range character in the game. Despite being a class designed to perform in long-range engagements, the Rogue is extremely mobile, which makes it an incredibly versatile class. You can either make the Rogue a self-sufficient DPS demon or a support character that provides amazing buffs to the whole team. In this guide, we've gone for the best of both worlds and created the most balanced and powerful Rogue build in Nino Kuni Cross Worlds. Rogue passive skills are the Attack Aura, Defense Aura, and Swift Movement. The first two passives, Attack Aura and Defense Aura, are the best passives to use for the Rogue class. These passive skills will increase the attack and defense of the entire party. Having skills that give an unconditional boost to your attack and defense are always the best ones to go with first. For the third passive, we have gone with Swift Movement. Every time you land five attacks in a row, this passive will increase your attack speed and movement speed. Since speed is one of the big selling points of the Rogue class, this passive capitalize on that to make the Rogue speed even better. Rogue special skills are the Overcharge Zone, Solar Flare, and Distortion Arrow. When you use the Overcharge Zone skill, the Rogue will spawn a flurry of wind which will increase the attack speed of the entire party by 5% and also recharge their burst gauge by 2.5%. 5% may not seem like a lot, but it will make a huge difference during battle. Your team will be able to dish out a significantly higher amount of damage as they will all be able to land attacks faster. With Solar Flare, the Rogue will summon a ball of light which will decrease the movement speed of all opponents nearby. It will then blow up, dealing 302% of your attack as light damage and stunning enemies for 3 seconds. This skill synergizes well with Overcharge Zone if used together. While the enemies are immobilized from Solar Flare, you can use Overcharge Zone to get an increase in attack speed and land a flurry of attacks on the enemies before they wake up. The Distortion Arrow skill allows the Rogue to fire an Arrow of Darkness which blows up when it hits a target, dealing 84% of attack as Darkness damage. It then pulls enemies towards itself and stuns them momentarily. This skill synergizes perfectly with Solar Flare. If you use it right after using Solar Flare, the enemies will be stun locked for a long time and you'll be able to kill them for free. The best familiars for Rogue are Flutterby, Hobgoblin, and Molten Lion. Flutterby and Hobgoblin are undisputedly the best familiars to use with the Rogue. Flutterby gives your Rogue a 20% increase in their movement speed, which is insane considering how fast the Rogue already is. On top of that, we know that the Rogue has high damage potential. Hobgoblin allows you to capitalize on that by reducing the critical strike defenses of your opponents, allowing you to deal massive amounts of damage. These two familiars buff the best aspects of the Rogue class. The third familiar for the Rogue build is up to preference. We have chosen the Molten Lion as it reduces damage from the attacks of your opponents. This will increase your Rogue's survivability on the battlefield. If you like this video don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Share this video, leave your comments, suggestions or request to our comments section below. Thank you for watching.